Hey guys, happy Monday. Before you start to throw the tomatoes at me, I know I have been missing in action, but with the military, we didn't know if we were about to get activated. You guys know, you see it in the news for the coronavirus. Not only that, I had some things going on in my personal life. All good, okay? So definitely you can send a prayer, but everything has been amazing. I'll show you that um, in a later video. But guys, when I tell you, I went out to get some essentials and in the little strip area, they had a TJ Maxx and a few other places. So I will show you a few videos. When I tell you this is the cleanest I have ever seen TJ Maxx, I had to go up to the employees and compliment them and applaud them. They had everything in the store fully stocked. Look at this makeup palettes, NARS. We had, look at how clean it is and stacked. Like, you know, TJ Maxx does not <laughs> look like this on a regular basis. And um, one of the employees did explain to me that hey, since people are not in there, they have taken this time to really stock and put things on clearance. Guys, this is the biggest clearance I have ever seen. So I'm not telling you to chance it. You didn't, you didn't hear me say that. I'm not telling you to chance it. But if you happen to be out, maybe getting some toilet tissue or whatever you need, and you can stop by your TJ Maxx, stop by there. Now, I didn't tell you to go out there. So let me just make sure that that is clear, okay? I did not say go out and catch a deal and possibly put your you or your family at risk. I did not say that, okay? But since I am out already and we only have about seven confirmed cases in my state, I'm out. I'm going to show you what they have and maybe this will take your mind off of some of that. Now, with that being said, guys, I do have a special guest. Listen. All right. Have you ever seen this store this clean? Never. Never. Never ever. Why do you think it looks like this with all this clearance and so clean? Is it the coronavirus? It's got to be. It's got to be. <laughs> and it's got to be. What's I wrong mean, with us that we're still in here shopping? Because it's all this clearance. It's all this clearance? Okay. And oh, it's organized. And it's organized. Oh, my gosh. Guys, look at this. This is all clearance. Not only is this clearance, I mean, look, I'm gonna take you guys like, you are not gonna believe this. This is clearance. And then this is clearance. Look at it. Like, have you ever guys seen that? And then we're gonna go over to the other side. And this is clearance as well. So look at all of that. And then on the other side, so guys, oh my gosh, we have never seen this. Are you guys ready to dig in? Are y'all ready to dig in? Cause I think we're gonna have to dig in. Oh my gosh. All right, let's see what we got. All right guys, so you already know these L'Oreal scrubs, you can find these at the drugstore. Now this is only $6, which at the drugstore, they're new, normally around like 12 to $15. They did have Clinique and this is $16. They have a lot of different items. This whole section is just mask. So I know you're going to be at home on with the children. And if you just want to get that self-care, meditation, zen moments going on, you know, if you have to lock yourself in the bathroom, you may want to grab a few masks and just practice that self-care and being at home. Now for a lot of you, this is going to be your new normal, but this is my normal, okay? Because I work from home. So I am used to being at home, me and my dog. For me, it's kind of weird because I go outside to escape being at home. So now I'm going to be stuck in the house. But if you are in the house, there's, you know, sometimes when I'm at work, I always put on a face mask or try to keep up with myself. So for those that this is your first time really being at home for the next few weeks, you want to keep yourself occupied. Okay. I'm just going to give you that tip because I've been there. And if you don't do that, you're going to drive yourself nuts. All right. So <laughs> they do have um, shampoo and different conditioner. Now, guys, this went as low as like $2 and I'm moving a little bit quickly. I know I need to slow down, but I'm moving a little bit quickly just because I really want to try to get to a few items just to see what they have. Um, I wanted to see was these items seasonal items, were these items expired, were these items, you know, like half empty. But when I did speak with the representative, they went and got rid of like all of the, you know, like the funky or torn um, products and you know how things be missing. They really did go ahead and do a deep dive to remove them. 
and they had everything from perfume sets, they had makeup sets, they had um, coconut oil, they had a lot of different items. They had so much clearance, guys, they didn't even know what to do with it. And I've never seen that before. And I love these little um, yogurt bombs. So if you haven't tried these from the body shop, you can pick them up at Ulta. They are amazing. That was only $2. This is $5.50. Like majority of the stuff that I seen that I came across was at least $10 or less, but a lot of it was $5. So you see them over there to the side and they're actually going through and, you know, straining up the different items, marking down more clearance. So they are doing their job. Now, I do feel sorry that they do have to work um, because, you know, I don't want them to be at risk. But since their job, I, you know, I can't make TJ Maxx shut down the store, you know, but since they are here, they are doing a great job at getting it cleared up. So I showed you over there the mask. Once again, they have like the Stella kits. These are $6 so or Stella, or I don't know what it's called because I never used it. So let me know. Give me a pronunciation breakdown in the comments. Okay. But they did have this makeup palette. It is only $3. Um, they had shoes on clearance. I did not show you shoes in here. I showed you a lot of home in this video and it's going to be a lot of makeup um, or beauty and I think furniture. So, but I'm just going through palettes everywhere, $2 palettes and it was not expired. So that is even great. Like it's not expired at all. And you can find something for your husband, for your children. Now look at this guys. Look at this. This is a full cart, just full of clearance items that they haven't even um, put out just yet. So they're going through and they're marking carts. So this full cart is nothing but red tag and clearance. And they had these all over the store from bins. Um, not only did they have bins, they had aisles full of just clearance. So I don't know. I'm not saying risk it. I did not say that. But what I'm saying is, oops. I, I did catch it. I'm not saying that, but what I am saying is that once everything clears, maybe you might want to hit up your TJ Maxx, okay? Because it was just so many things. I could not believe it. And then I'm going to show you one more area over here as well. Now, this was a lot more of the perfumes. Um, and this was like the Elizabeth Arden. And this was eight or nine dollars. And then this, I don't know, I've never heard of this brand perfume. But once again, eight dollars, nine dollars, not bad at all. Um, if you need these things. Now, with that being said, I know that a lot of people are out of work or you don't know how to pay your bills. Once again, guys, be mindful. The video is not to just, you know, say, hey, you need to go out there and get it. That is not what I do. I want to save you money. I want to show you what's in stores, but be mindful of your budget. So if your budget, if you can't do this, your circumstances have changed, it's all good. Okay. The one thing that we know about sales, there will always be a sale. Alrighty. And then for those that need shampoo and conditioner, they do have more shampoo and conditioner as well. Um, you guys know how I feel about this brand. I think it's the Macadamia. Absolutely love it. So I love to find it on sale. But once again, they were just going through and I'm pretty sure there was going to be more items added to this as well. So I'm just going through and just showing you if you do need shampoo and conditioner, um, you could definitely find it. And I think this one was like, what, $4.50 and it's the coconut oil sulfate free. So, and then they had some more makeup palettes and just different things. And this was only, I want to say... It was around like four dollars, right? So great deals going on right now. You cannot beat some of the stuff. And yeah, let's go ahead and go over to another section. All right, guys, so there is clearance all over the store. Now they do have shoes and pajamas and a lot of those items. So you see behind me, this whole rack is just shoes. Um, when I was actually glancing at the shoes, I think the lowest I found a pair was like for $8. So they still were a little bit pricey. And I mean, from like $8 at the lowest price and going all the way up to about, 
I would say about $25, $27. Now, all of these tables are clearance, guys. So we have everything from home, from candles to knickknacks. This huge candle is only $6. This little relaxed candle kit is about $10. They have the different, um, so this is lavender and chamomile, and they have like the different scents. I thought these were some perfect gifts. Now, for those that are, this is your first time watching my videos, we know that TJ Maxx and Marshalls do like the yellow clearance tag sales and those are always done in July and in January. However, I will say this, that if you can find red ticket items like this Yankee candle, it may be great for you to go ahead and purchase some of those because it may not make it to yellow tag. Now, here's just a quick fact. I don't think you guys care, but the Yankee candles and different candles that are sold like in other places outside of the Yankee candle store, those are like the second and third pour. So sometimes like if you ever notice Yankee candles smell a little bit different, the first pour is going to be the freshest pour. Got it? I don't think you care, but just a little tidbit, okay? Now, guys, this is a bin, a bin. So you see the bin in front, and then there's a bin in back, and this is full of clearance items as well. So they have like basket items. They have like your little beach bags. They have notepads, everything. This is $2. Uh, for this notepad or your magnet set. They had thank you cards, um, different little random items, cards on there. And so this were where they were going through and just literally scanning and they were um, actually putting it into this basket. So they haven't even put it on the floor for you to just, well, it's on the floor, but I mean like actually put it in the aisle for you to go ahead and see it. And I mean, they had everything that you could use for like your home especially if you needed storage containers if you needed picture frames if you were going to be decorating your office this is definitely the route to go and then moving along of course they have like your notebooks your dividers um these were like two dollars and they just had like a lot of different random items cookbooks Nonetheless, I will say this, look, like it was just fun to be able to find so many red ticket items because I'm not used to this. And like I said, they just have a little bit more time. So this was some more storage boxes that they had available. And these storage boxes were, I think they were $8. So which is great. I love using this to put like mail in or to hide different items, more storage containers and just random Nick Nacks as well. Now, um, I did check like the actual bedding. They had a lot of bedding as well. I don't think I included that clip in here. And that's just because this video is already 20 minutes. And I know you guys are at home, but still, you know. <laughs> now, this is another full aisle of clearance. On here, it had everything from mugs, cups, butter, um, like you, the little butter containers, glasses, um, any and everything that you can use in your kitchen. They had stuff that you don't even know or think that you need. So look, I'm gonna go ahead and try to pan out. So this whole mess of hoarder chaotic this um is for this aisle so like this is something i don't think i need like where you could put your eggs in there you boil your eggs and i'm just going through they had wall art home decor they even had cleaning supplies not only cleaning supplies they had um what are these things i think you put them in your closet just like odor fresheners to actually make the room or the closet smell fresh. They also have more candles, which you guys know I am a candle lover. So they had candles and salt and pepper and just um, all types of things that you may need. It was so much stuff. I was scared that I was going to knock something down. Um, but these are great gifts, especially like these glass and wine sets. And I mean, some of the things you want to think at, think of, guys, is like we are wedding season is upon us. Now, I don't know how the coronavirus is going to affect all of that. But um, for a lot of times, some of the wedding gifts, people ask for glasses and wine glasses and different things. So you can find wine glass sets for as low as like $4 for a four or six piece, which isn't bad. 
Now, moving along, I thought these were super cute, especially um, like these little cups. Like if you were going to have this summer like a picnic or you were going to pack a picnic, great photo opportunities. They had Burt's Bees for dogs, which were $2. I mean, galore, galore. <laughs> like you see, it is so much stuff. I'm like, oh my gosh, they have mug sets. It looks like they just went through and just started marking. And this butter dish, they had the sets to go with it earlier. I showed you the tea. They had shower caddies, shoe caddies. They even had, um, what was it? The shower curtains. So I know before, guys, I had showed you about TJ Maxx and their $2 shower curtains and different things that they do as well. I may link that video down below. So if you haven't seen um, some old videos and Guys, since you're out, catch up on some of my older videos, okay? How about that? Um, they also had like Mickey and Minnie Mouse aprons, just any and everything that you can think of. Like if you think that you may need it, it's more than likely right now on clearance. So once all of this is over with, I'm sure if we get to the stores, the stores are going to have so many deals and sales. But let me know, how are you doing? Because I don't think I asked that. And I think that's a little bit rude, right? Because I'm from the South. And in the South, you can't walk in no one's house and not speak to them. So you know what? I'm sorry. Hey, y'all. <laughs> how are you, you doing? Or what are you doing during this um, shutdown? You know, what are you doing? How are you staying busy? So once again, they have like teacher's gifts as well. More thank you cards and just more glass sets. So I'm going to go over and we're going to check out another few more areas. Now, I'm debating, guys. I'm really debating because they do also have these, which are your um, board cutters. And I might have said the cutting board. There you go. And then on the table, this is just another table full of clearance. So you can get these four mugs or um, coffee, tea, whatever you want to use them for. They're $8, which is $2 a piece. Not bad at all. They had salt and pepper, um, or these might be like your cream and sugar that you can put. I'm not sure. I'm looking to see exactly. But it was like a full B set. So this may be your cream and sugar set. And I thought this was cute for like spring and summer. If you are the type that likes to decorate outside, definitely. And these, once again, $2, $3. They even had Ray Dunn. Oh my gosh. So you can't beat that. These Tommy Bahama, these are some actual wine glasses and they are four dollars and fifty cents for a four pack and these tommy bahama i think they were and they were like five dollars or it wasn't more than five or six dollars and just more glass so a lot of glass if you need that or you know someone that is moving into a place you definitely may want to get that as well and these were six dollars so I'll go ahead and take you a little bit more throughout the store because there was so much like guys, I couldn't show you all of it. It was so much. They even had furniture. So this is just some more knickknacks. If you're into your plants, they did have plants and some of the times you got to watch these, right? Because the price might be $7 and they only take off a dollar. I guess it's a savings, but it's not as low as I would want it to go. However, if it does stay until July, it would be part of the yellow ticket um, tag on there. So, and these are just little random knickknacks to place around the house. So if you want to do that now, a lot of times for me, when it comes to like knickknacks, I go to the thrift store because I feel like you can find this stuff in the thrift store as well. But they did have furniture um, that was on sale, which is surprising because I never catch red ticket furniture like people always buy it. So they did have that. And not only did they have furniture this is the newer furniture. So of course, this is not on sale. Um, but not only did they have furniture, but they had clothes, they had children's clothes. And like I said, guys, I will show you the children's clothes and I'm gonna start have to do like two parts of these videos. Okay, I just I just got to I just have to. All right. So this is coming to an end. This is what they have in our store. Just some of the items. I do like those actual tier teal 
chairs in the back and you see I'm moving just to kind of see them a little bit better because I think these would work so perfect in my house and these were not on sale of course not why do I always find stuff that's not on sale those were a hundred dollars a piece but I thought the color was nice especially just to brighten up my area and this is right here is still all the furniture that is regular price and you can see some of them have the red tickets on there so this was $39.99 and I, or $59.99 and it's marked down to $39 if I seen that correctly and then moving along if you look straight ahead there was more back there so I'm just walking through the store and I'm about to get ready to head out it wasn't that many people in the store um, but guys, I definitely want you to be safe. Please like, comment, subscribe. I am back. Okay. I am back and be well. Talk to you later. Bye.